Okay, so this is just a quick tip for some people who are retargeting stuff in the Unreal Engine 5. Um, if you follow some tutorials online and you get your retargeting done like this and all your animations like work fine now with the with your with your other mesh. Uh, many tutorials out there tell you to then go and export all the animations for the new mesh. And I think that's, to be honest, uh, really not the best way to do it, because um, instead of having every animation you want to use on a different uh, on a different mesh, to have them all clutter up your project, you can actually do something else. You can use um, the the normal Unreal Engine Five skeleton. Um, one second. So. You have like the normal skeleton and the the um, the the animation blueprint like this, and if you want to have your um, other animation blueprint instead of like using um, using your new exported animations, you can actually go and use this retarget pose from mesh component. Um, you can just look. Go here and retarget post from mesh like this, and then you go and choose this for your other mesh. And you can see here, like I don't have any animations really for this, um, for this, for this, uh, for this mesh. Um, these are just some sample animations from from this character, but I won't use them. And when you've done when you've done that, you can uh, at this uh, node you can choose the retargeter. That's where you um, that's what I showed you, where you would like export the animations. And then you can choose this here. And what you can do now is like um, you open up your your character like you have um, this. So you have your character like here. And normally you would just use your um, you would just use your the standard um, standard um, Unreal Engine uh, mesh. And what you do now is you actually put another mesh under this one, like the mesh you actually want to use. Um, you will make this one invisible and for, for example if you want to use like weapons and stuff you put them under the retargeted mesh but um, because it's under in the hierarchy it's under the uh, standard mesh you will um, it will use the original animations one thing you have to keep in mind is that you tick this box here like always tick pose and refresh bones in the optimization tab for the original mesh, the um, the 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 Unreal Engine Five mesh, because otherwise it won't update the bones when it's invisible, and this mesh will now copy the animation from the original mesh, from the um, from the Unreal Engine Five mesh, and what this all um, does is that you don't have to export all the animations uh, for every mesh you use. For example, if you want to look, like use this uh, run animation or something like um, or the attack animations, for example, I don't know what's how to write. Sorry, like uh, combo attack, whatever. Um, if you want to look, if you want to use those animations for different meshes, you would have to export the animation for every mesh. But this way you can actually use the standard Unreal Engine uh, 5 or Unreal Engine 4 in this uh, this case uh, mesh for every character and just retarget them like on the fly. This is actually shown in a, in a video on the Unreal Engine 5 um, YouTube channel, this method. I found it there and it's, in my opinion, it's way um, it's way better than the like export everything. I hope it was a little bit clear what I want to uh, demonstrate. Some people asked me about this, and um, yeah, I will. I, I hope it uh, it's it's uh, yeah, it's good.
Okay. Thanks.